Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to my video. I just want to give you guys a quick tip and an easy tip. You guys have a Nissan and you guys have a no start issue where on the dash it says no key detected. It's not detecting the key. But obviously you have the remote, you have the fob key with you and I'm going to show you guys how to start your vehicle a couple ways. Sometimes uh, in these situations, the battery runs dead on your key fob and you don't know it. And that's going to cause uh, issues with your vehicle being able to read your remote. Other times there might be, uh, for whatever reason, a glitch in the programming of um, your uh, your key even though it wasn't reprogrammed there might be a glitch somewhere in the system that causes this issue and you get a no start it won't start everything lights up and work but but you still get the no key detected now if you guys are in this situation you guys can't get into your car because your remote your car's not reading your remote um, Okay, just to start off, there's a there's, there's a manual key that's in the remote itself. Just look at your remote. All right, you're gonna press on the side, get the key out, and then you can open the door. But once you get in, you try to start it. It won't it won't start. However, when you press the um, the push start, everything else works. And if you guys run into this situation, um, here's definitely what you guys want to do and you guys in in a lot of cases this could probably be um a, a way to, to 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 um get you going without having to go and uh get a battery to replace on your key fob so first thing you're gonna do is all right you're gonna want to touch your the, the corner of your key you're gonna want to touch the key to the push dot so what you want to do you want to touch the key to the push start literally touch the key to the push start amazingly um, your vehicle has um, has a way to input enough of a, of a of a charge into it's a very 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 minor charge um, into your key fob to actually read it to get the car started all right um it's a very 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 tiny charge it has to be very 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 close to the push dot all right uh, in most cases what you might want to do is you might actually want to use the corner of the remote itself and push the push dot now in cases where you do that and you still don't uh won't be you still won't be able to get your car to start and you still get that message that says no key detected there's a second way there's a second way for you to get your key started your car started in this situation and what you guys want to do is you guys want to check around on the left side of the steering wheel around the dash there's gonna be a little slot okay look for a slot it's gonna be a slot it's going to be just a little bit below the steering wheel. It's going to be where the, uh, the, 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 the three buttons are below the vent. There's going to be a slot for your fob key remote. All right. What you want to do is you want to pop that fob key remote into that slot. Pop into that slot and then try to start your vehicle. Like in most cases, um, you're going to be able to start it without a problem with that method on top of that it also reprograms your key i've been told i've heard that it also reprograms the key so that the computer um, can read it um, a lot easier all right so if you guys are stuck in this situation where you guys have a no key detected uh, situation because your fob key might 
have a dead battery or might have uh, some um, I don't know some programming issues on the key you and you guys need to start your vehicle Definitely definitely try those two things out. All right. Um, hope this has helped you guys out Definitely leave a comment in the comment section if you guys have an opinion on this or if you guys have your own um, Personal experience with this situation or other ways to start. I'm you know in this situation I'm not quite sure if there's any other ways um, to start it if your key is the is the key for the vehicle but you're still getting a uh no key detected message this is pretty much the only two ways to start your car or vehicle with um a dead key fob or battery all right i hope this that this has helped you guys out and uh hope that it gets you guys going all right guys leave a comment please give me a thumbs up and subscribe all right, all right guys take care